Hello everyone, welcome to Wednesday. We just had another sideways day, 19 in a row now that we've been sitting in this range. Uh, it's not a bad thing. It's better to be going sideways than down in this type of environment, so that we're okay with that. I will talk about uh, really one of the holdings that was at the top of my list today for return, uh, and that had to do with the cybersecurity holdings. There's 31 holdings inside of all of our uh, investments, and this was number one today and actually made money even though the market was down. And cybersecurity, of course, is you know protecting your business from outside intrusion. There's a lot more reliance upon data and big data and people storing data. And so obviously keeping that safe is becoming more important. When you take uh, an environment like we've got now and you distribute all these people into their homes, uh, there's going to be some more cybersecurity expenditures on products and services and software. Um, and so that's one of the reasons I think this type of investment is doing quite well. Cybersecurity is interesting. In 2014, according to this BlackRock report, uh, there was only one cyber uh, criminal on the FBI's most wanted list, and now there are 42. So this is kind of a growth business in the hacking arena, and of course that makes it more money is being spent to protect against that. Uh, and only 16% of risk managers felt like their companies were well prepared for, for cybersecurity uh, intrusion. And of course, this is creating a huge growth opportunity in the cybersecurity arena, even before the pandemic. So putting everybody home, a lot more money's coming into that, and we're seeing those stocks outperform, uh, even in an environment where things aren't that great sometimes uh, with some of the other information that's coming out. So I wanna thank you very much uh, for listening to me today, and I hope I get a chance to talk to you tomorrow. Thank you.